Today, we are on to week number four against the Tennessee Titans. We will be on the road today in our first divisional game against the Titans. So let's get into it. QB1 check-in. By the way, hope you guys are enjoying this series. If you are, hit that like button. Uh, comment below what you guys think of the team and, you know, any changes that you guys want to see. Also, if you guys aren't su subscribed, please do. Uh, it really helps out the channel. And uh, we're almost at 6K, so let's get there. Uh, Coach Anthony Richardson has been one of the top passers in terms of yards so far this season. Is he? Uh, is the plan to continue to be so pass heavy? Um, That's a good question. I think we strive for balance. Ideally, we'd like to have more balance. Being a one-dimensional team will eventually catch up to you. So in perfect world, that pace slows down a bit, but our offense is just as lethal. Yeah, uh, I think we want to be balanced to a point, but if we want to win games and we want to win a Super Bowl, we're going to have to throw the ball, and we're going to have to throw the ball really, really well. Uh, and obviously, we got to stop this guy. Derrick Henry, he is a problem for us. Uh, so that's a big deal. And then I saw one of you guys coming to do throw it deep instead of throw it um, medium. Which, I mean, uh, slower DB, run support. Um, okay, I could see it. Let, let's, let's try it out and uh, see how that goes. And then for our game plan goals, again, we'll do the same. Four three turnovers. Uh, against Tennessee, let's try and allow 20 or less. Will be kind of tough because I think their offense has been really good this year. And we'll go for the yards as well. And let's get these yards out, out of the way. Okay, so Shaq Leonard has a broken finger. So he is out. And Brian Holmes is out. Oh my gosh. Okay, so basically our whole linebacker core is hurt. That's awesome. Uh, good news is Desmond Groth uh, Crothers is back. After missing last week, uh, Nick Cross, let's give him run support because <laughs> we may need it. <laughs> he may have to play a little bit of linebacker today. Uh, so, yeah, he's upgraded. We still have Justin Snow. So we still have our superstar linebacker in there. Uh, but at this point, I think we're going to be starting two rookies at linebacker today, which isn't great. Atkins. Um, oh, I guess Duval is healthy. Never mind. Okay. So, yeah, I mean, this will be a good chance for Duvall um, to show what he can do. Uh, and then, ooh, let me get Moses as a backup. Well, yeah, let me get, hmm, how do I want to do this? Let's get Moses in there for a backup instead of Chapman, because that's awful. Don't want to do that. And then we'll put Chapman back at defensive tackle now that Krathos is back. We are ready to go here in Tennessee. And look who the starting quarterback is for the Tennessee Titans. Trey Lance. 612 yards, three touchdowns, two interceptions on the year. Obviously, Trey Lance was a big part of this team a year ago when Anthony Richardson got injured. We traded for Trey Lance, and he stepped in and, and played well enough to put us in position to be a playoff team as immediately... Derrick Henry has a huge run, a gain of 24 on the play. And we have struggled against Derrick Henry over the last couple of years. I just can can they trade him, please? Like, he's just a disaster for us. <laughs> DeForest Buckner makes a nice play. I'm excited to see Trey Lance today, though. Uh, good for him, finding a starting role. Obviously, it, the way he played a year ago helped... Uh, get him a, a, a job in uh, in the league, which is awesome. A starting job. As that pass is complete by Trey Lance. And it will be third and five. Julius Brenton coverage there. Obviously, we're missing Shaq Leonard. We're missing uh, Brian Holmes. Two starting linebackers. And that, we're going to get called for holding. It doesn't matter. A wide open receiver. And he will be all the way down to the 10 or 11 yard line. There is a penalty, it's gonna be illegal contact because the, the dumbass receiver ran into me, but whatever. So first and 10 from the 11. 
We'll see what Tennessee does here. They'll go ahead and hand it off to Derrick Henry. And that goes nowhere. So after the first run, Henry hasn't had much room there. And that's Moses, the rookie linebacker, making the play. So second and 10. And Lance back to throw. It's a quick pass out to uh, Burks. Is it Burke or Burks? Burks. And it's a gain of a couple. So third and nine. See if our defense can hold here on on third down and just hold him to a field goal. And Lance will get it to Burke. Oh my gosh. Come on, guys. Traylon Burks gets into the end zone. Touchdown, Tennessee. Two guys over there. Burks cuts inside, makes a nice move, and no one can get out there. And that will be a 7 nothing lead to start off this game for Tennessee. We have really struggled against Tennessee, man. R like... Tennessee and Jacksonville, we have really, really struggled over the last two years. We got blown out last year against Tennessee. That basically won them the division. So, yeah, it's it hasn't been a good time playing the Tennessee Titans, and we find ourselves immediately down 7-0. Anthony Richardson will head out for uh, our first drive offensively, offensively 563 yards, six touchdowns, four interceptions. Most of the interceptions coming from, obviously, or well, half of them coming from the one game earlier this year where he threw for like 50 yards. So yeah, all of that is, is basically the reason why his numbers aren't as good. JT with the carry, it's a gain of one, 16 carries and 90 yards and a touchdown last week. This is a team where we really haven't run the ball well against. So hopefully we can find a way to uh, make some plays in the passing game as I, I didn't really see anyone open. And Simmons will come in and get the sack and it will be third and long. I mean, this is what our offense has been against this team. Like That's just how it's been. I wanted to go to Saunders and I didn't really love it. Um, but we'll go to him now. See if he can make a play here. He breaks it. No, he can't break the tackle. It'll be fourth and seven. It's a gain of 11. We'll have to punt. Not a good start. And that pass will be complete. I don't know how that was completed, but it was. And it's a gain of 19. DeAndre Hopkins with the catch. Uh, dude, that, that needs to be a turnover, if anything. And Derrick Henry gets to the outside. And, oh, he's hurt. Thank God. Goodness gracious, man. Our defense just cannot stop this team. I mean, it's brutal. I don't understand why we cannot stop the Tennessee Titans. They stink. Crothers. No, he can't get the sack. And Trey Lance is able to throw it away. Unbelievable. By the way, that's Lance's first incompletion of the game. I would say it's a revenge game for him, but it's not really. Like, he was never going to be the starting quarterback, right? He came in. He helped us out. And, and we helped him out by getting a starting role. So it's not really a revenge game. It's more of a get to see you game, <laughs> you know? Third and seven. We're going to press. We're going to blitz. See how Trey Lance does under pressure here. And under pressure is Duvall. And he gets rid of it. It's completed. And I hate this defense. I hate, I hate this defense. I, I don't get it, man. I don't get what I'm supposed to do. And no one can tackle on this freaking team. I mean, they are awful. That's going to be a flag. Good Lord. Oh, my God, this team. Whenever we play the Titans, we turn into just the worst possible team you could have. We can't tackle. We can't block. We can't stop the run. We can't cover. We can't. Make a play on the ball. Just nothing. We stink against this team. What is it? Second and five. We took off with uh, Anthony Richardson. Uh, no, they're going to see it. Okay. Uh, apparently, I can't change my play. Can I go to inside zone? We're going to fall start, aren't we? No. All right. We'll hand it off here. Zach Moss, a big carry. And that's a gain of uh, 13. So the offense finally gets a first down. 
Let's uh, audible here. Might go to hole or Pittman underneath, and I pressed the wrong button. All right. Don't know why I thought B was RB, but uh, that's what we pressed. Sweet. Again, when I play this team, I just I turn into a freaking pumpkin. Nice throw to Taj Holloman. And that will be a cross midfield to the 37-yard line. Oh, it's a gain of 20. And we'll go ahead and throw it again here. And we'll just take off. Slide, Richardson. Goodness. Second and four. Two rushes for 11 yards. I don't know how this is going to work if uh, we bootleg out to the left side here. And I don't really see much open. We'll get it to downs underneath, though. And that will be a first down. So Richardson, 3 of 4. 40 yards passing. 30 seconds to go here in quarter number one. We'll go play action again. And we'll go over the middle. We have Michael Pittman. And Pittman's down to the 5. There we go. Looking good. Five seconds. Let's try and get a snap off here. Might look to JT. And we will. Nope. They, the defense read that one. We should have went to Pittman. Ah! That's frustrating. All right. Well, that will end the first quarter. We're down 14 and nothing. But our offense is finally moving the ball here. From the two-yard line. I don't, I don't love it. Um... I'm going to have, let's do this, and then let's do you. Okay. We have Saunders running in, Branson Taylor blocking, Downs on the zig, Pittman on the slant. Here we go. And we've got Josh Downs, and it's inaccurate. <laughs> uh, this game makes me just... Oh, okay. Okay. Let's try to hand it off here to JT up the middle. Nope, that goes nowhere. I should have thrown it. I should have threw it. Well, fourth and goal. We're going to go for it. We're going to spread it out. No one in the backfield. Pittman's going to run a slant. And we've got Saunders. Saunders drops it. Unbelievable. Unbelievable, man. This is what I have to deal with against this team. I don't get it. I do not get why nothing works against this team. It just blows my mind. It is a run, and it's a run to the outside, and here goes Derrick Henry. Five carries, 57 yards. He's averaging over 10 yards per carry. We can't stop him. This is unbelievable. 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 Second and inches, wide open receiver. And that will be caught. Trey Lance is 7 of 8, 110 yards and two touchdowns. I mean, we've already been blown out this year. I, you cannot call us even a playoff contender at this point. You can't. And Derrick Henry hurdles. Yeah, I, this one's over. We're not winning this game. Trey Lance and the Titans now down into... Close to the red zone. Not quite into the red zone, but close. And down goes Trey Lance. It's the rookie, Dylan Moses. I think it's Dylan. Can't remember. Pretty sure it's Dylan. Good job, Dylan. <laughs> Second and 20. That's what we needed. Prevent them from running the ball. And make Trey Lance make tough decisions, and that ball is perfect. Unbelievable. And it's third and two. Trey Lance is killing us, man. He is absolutely killing us. Third and two for Tennessee here. They're going to throw it. And it'll be a quick throw. Incomplete. That was dropped. And with 425 to go, they're going to go for it here in the first half. Unbelievable. We're going to give up a first down, aren't we? Fourth and two. They're going to hand it off. And Henry is going to score a touchdown. Yeah, I don't I don't get it, man. I don't get why we're we're not allowed to even be close to beating this team. Like we get 
it's not that we just lose against Tennessee. We get blown out against the Titans. 10 plays, 97 yards in four minutes. I, I don't... The sliders are really... And I don't even know if it's the sliders. I think it's just the game and how dumb the game is. It's either we blow out a team or we get blown out. And that wasn't the case last year. It's just this season. I don't get it. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. The sliders have not changed since last season. I did not change it this year. For those of you asking, I have not. Find the game that I last changed it last year. That's been the sliders. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do here. It's a blowout every time. We got Michael Pittman. It's not even close. Pittman doesn't stop. But, you know, on the slant that he's going to be wide open over the middle, he will stop right, be right behind a defender, and we're going to throw a pick. Because that happens, apparently. Third and 11. We've got Pittman. Shocked he didn't stop there. That'll be a first down. 6 of 10 for Richardson, seven, 78 yards. We, if we don't score here, it is, this is over. It's over. We're not going to win this game. We have no, zero shot if we don't score here. We'll get this to Taj Holloman. Good blocking up front. They blitzed. We'll uh, keep them in that defense. And... Ah, uh, no, Pittman didn't get open. We tried to get out of there. We couldn't. And we're going to be sacked. I shouldn't have no huddle that. Of course, you know, the defense would perfectly adjust and figure it out. Second and 16. And I'm going to take off again. Richardson will go ahead and slide down to the 43-yard line. And it will be third and three. Um, And we'll let it hit the two-minute warning. Which is fine. Uh, we don't want them to have the ball here again in the first half because we all know they're just going to magically go down the field and score a touchdown. So third and three. And I'm going to take off and just get it myself. Downs with a nice block, but I saw Byron on the left side there, so I just wanted to get down. Don't want to risk anything. We can't afford to lose Richardson this year. We don't have Trey Lance, who's, you know... Patrick Mahomes against us. And this will just be thrown away. That's fine. Third and 10 just had a inaccurate pass to a wide open receiver. Pretty sweet. We'll run the screen here. And luckily, JT had a little speed boost to the outside there. That's going to be a first down with a minute and 16 to go. JT with his second catch. 15 yards. They're going to blitz here. Oh, maybe not. Uh, they did. I don't really see anyone open. We're going to have to throw it away. Richardson's 8 of 15. I, you know, and one thing I noticed too after last game, like our completion percentage is going to be insanely low just because we get, you know, we get the, the crappy inaccurate throws or the ridiculous drops. And so, that I mean, that sucks because it's not going to be super realistic you know with that but i mean that's the game that we you know have to pay 70 dollars for and that pass is gonna be knocked away it took way too long to throw that it's gonna be fourth and five i mean i'm going for it taj holloman ran that route way faster than i thought he would i mean he came flying out of the break there and that's going to be inaccurate. There is a flag. I, you know, and I was thinking we shouldn't go for it on fourth down. Because we're going to get an inaccurate throw no matter what. Luckily, we got bailed out with the flag there. So first in goal. And we're going to go to Taj Holloman again, inaccurate under pressure. And we're at 9 of 18 now, 50%. Uh, this game's just absolute garbage. It's absolute garbage, man. I mean, Richardson's accuracies are in the mid-80s, close to 90. Some of them might be 90 at this point. It's just so dumb. That'll be a rushing touchdown for Richardson because we know we can't throw it. 
God forbid, you know, we get an accurate freaking throw. We'll make it 21-7. Oh, that gets through? Are you kidding me? What am I supposed to do, guys? What, what am I supposed to do? I run zone, they're wide open. I run man, and the ball goes through two of my guys and gets completed. Derrick Henry running up the middle. That runs out the clock. Derrick Henry already has uh, over 100 yards. <laughs> Dude, this, this game. We're across midfield to the 46-yard line. Really because we're running the ball well, except for, you know, there. JT, 6 carries, 16 yards. It doesn't look like we're running the ball well statistically, but we had two good runs, and of course now we're unable to run the ball. Which is terrific, and we have Pittman. Will we get an accurate throw? We get an amazing catch by Michael Pittman. The, the game is not giving us any accurate throws, man. Our throw on runs like an 85. Like, give me one. Good lord. Uh, we've got downs over the middle. Again, inaccurate, kind of. Didn't look accurate. It says perfect accuracy. Didn't look like it. Downs makes another diving catch. Um, I might take a shot here. Oops. To, uh, to Pittman. And we will. Can we get it? Michael Pittman! Touchdown! What a throw! Finally! Finally, some offensive success, and Michael Pittman Jr. will cut this lead to seven. Now, can we stop the Titans? No, probably not. Derrick Henry's in the zone. He's been in the zone since, like, the first quarter. Uh, we can't stop him. We can't. We would, we would have to get... Uh, oh, that was dropped or knocked away. Not sure. Julius Brentson coverage there. That's what we need Tennessee to do. Throw the ball. <laughs> Throw it. Don't run it. Please. And it's a run. And when we... Uh, it's off the side that we blitz. Third and one. Uh, okay. I Yeah. I mean, I don't... Not really sure what to do in this situation. Henry right up the middle. And... He has 12 carries for 148 yards. DeForest Buckner, Chapman, you guys gonna do anything in the middle there? Or are you just gonna stand and pick your nose? Because that's basically what you guys are doing. A quick pass and somehow Kenny Moore doesn't make a play on that. What is happening? Like, that's like... That's like the fourth time we should have intercepted Trey Lance. It's so stupid. And a wide open receiver. Again, if we run man, the ball goes through three of my defenders. If I run zone, wide open. I, wh what am I supposed to do, man? This is absolutely ridiculous. And Henry up the middle, breaks a tackle because he's in the zone. 13 carries, 154 yards. He's just going to run it in here. There's really nothing I can do. And run up the middle. Easy touchdown. We're across midfield to the 39. I, it takes us forever to just get down the field, man. We have to literally be perfect. We can't hit big plays. Nothing's open downfield. Yeah, it's, it's just one of those days. We'll take off with Richardson, and it'll be second in inches. 53 yards rushing for Anthony Richardson. Uh, Michael Pittman has like three or four catches on this drive alone because we're just basically running drags to him. And he's wide open. Finally, a big play. And we'll have first and goal down to the five. And that will end the third quarter. Eight catches, 121 yards for Michael Pittman Jr., if we can score a touchdown and get the... Uh, we haven't... By the way, I just want to say, the defense has not gotten a single stop. Like a single one. Not one. Um, like, that's that's been the problem. We're going to run it in again with Richardson. Yep. Second rushing touchdown of the day for Anthony Richardson. And we'll go ahead and make it a one-score game. K-9. 
Can our defense finally get a stop? What a play by Crothers! And we brought Henry down for a loss. It's a loss of three. Deo Odengbo got there as well, but De Desmond Crothers was in the inside there, and it worked out. So Henry is out of the zone. That was step one. <laughs> step two is to... Uh, well, now he... Okay, well, did not expect that. And eh, that's a gain of seven. I was going to say step two is get pressure on Trey Lance. But that didn't happen. Third and three now. I mean, I'm assuming they're going to run it here. And they will. And down goes Henry. Finally. It will be fourth and four. DeForest Buckner got there. Gilmore got there. Odengbo was in there. Finally, we get a stop. Tennessee has now punted for the first time in this game. And, ooh, Greer with a nice move to the outside. Again, I the, the depth chart changes that, like, twice or once every two weeks. And I, I don't see it. It's just annoying. Because it should be Holloman. I mean, if that was Holloman, that could have been a huge play. We'll go with a nice cut back by... Jonathan Taylor, and that's a gain of 10. Nine carries, 33 yards. I, we really haven't been able to get much going on the ground. That's why we haven't run it a whole lot. I know some of you might be saying run the ball more. We literally haven't been able to do much, but finally, Jonathan Taylor gets free. And now, I mean, the yards per carry is looking much better. It, I mean, he had like seven carries for 15 yards at one point. So, <laughs> you know, like... Let's go play action here. That worked out really well. We've got Pittman. Nice throw. And Michael Pittman breaks a tackle. And he's down to the 15. Beautiful. This is what it should look like. Just under six minutes to go. We're going to run it. And Taylor. Ooh, nice block by Nelson. I didn't think Quentin Nelson would get there for that block. 11 carries, 62 yards. And now we're down to the five. Let's run the ball here. Make sure we get a first down. Then we have four shots at the end zone here. And Moss up the middle. And he's down to the two. Do we spread it out? Um, hmm. This is an interesting play. I don't know if this will work, but we can try it. And Evan Hole is wide open. He stopped. Why did he stop? Keep running. Oh, my gosh, dude. Oh, okay, I should have just ran the ball. I, I was like, oh, that's an interesting play. Like, let's try that. Nope. We might have Saunders. It's inaccurate. And Saunders didn't run the post. He just, what, he, what was he doing? This is a disaster. Absolute disaster. Um... All right, third and goal. And that's going to be nearly picked. Downs ran started running inside instead of just staying on the outside there. And we're going to go for it. Yeah, kind of have to. Wow. Looks like they're blitzing. Okay. Let's try this. We've got Pittman. That's going to be caught. Touchdown, Michael Pittman Jr. And this game is tied. Well, we're down by one. Let's make sure we kick this field goal and, and hit it. It's good. We are tied. Nine plays, 65 yards, three minutes. It was a disaster at the goal line. But on fourth down, we punch it in. Michael Pittman Jr. with an outstanding game. He's been quiet this season, but a huge game today. By the way, Anthony Richardson has two passing touchdowns and two rushing touchdowns in this game. We have momentum here with four minutes to go. Can our defense get a stop? And uh, can we go down and score here? I'm going to put Crothers in the middle here. Has this been working? Ah, they, ah, I guessed right. They went left. Crothers tracked Derrick Henry down, but it will be a gain of 10. 
and that'll be a first down. We need to move Crothers around here. I think that's what we're going to have to do. Because he, I mean, he's by far the best player here. And, oh, that's going to be a sack. It worked out. Desmond Crothers comes flying in. It'll be second and 18. Woof. That dude's unbelievable, man. <laughs> he is so good. He is so good. Second and 18. And that's going to be caught by Hopkins. It'll be gain of five. Third and 13 now. I, I'm going to blitz. I'm going to stick to it. We're going to blitz. And we're going to try and get pressure on Trey Lance here. And that will be caught. But a nice tackle by Brian Branch. And it will be fourth and five. And Tennessee will punt. We will have just... We'll have about two minutes here. Yeah, they're going to still punt the ball here. They probably should have let the two-minute warning hit, to be honest. And we'll have one play here before the two-minute warning. At the 13-yard line, Michael Pittman Jr., 10 catches, 146 yards, and two touchdowns. He's been phenomenal in this game. Uh, We're going to run it up the middle. And oh, that ain't going anywhere. That's not what we wanted. So second and 10. Damn it. That's really not what we wanted there. I'm going to get it underneath here to Austin Saunders. And that will be third and inches. And I'm going to go read option here and just hand it off to Zach Moss. And that will be a first down Zach Moss. All right. Let's call a timeout. A minute and a half to go. We're only at the 28 yard line. So... Let's just make sure that we're going to have enough time here. All we need is a field goal, right? We don't need to go down and score a touchdown, but I just want to make sure we have time. Let's get it to Jonathan Taylor, and it's a gain of seven. I don't mind running the ball here. And JT, no. Oh, Simmons got right through. Jesus, okay. 13 carry, 62 yards for... Jonathan Taylor. So third and three. We got to be careful here. They're in the zone. Or, well, Simmons is in the zone. I'm going to have Saunders just running out. And we'll get it to him. Saunders makes the catch. And they're going to give us fourth and inches. Do I do this? Oh, my God. That's such a horrible spot. I might call a timeout here if I don't like it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Brotherly shove. The tush bush and Richardson's hurt. <laughs> uh, he might have a concussion. He was absolutely drilled. Marcus Mariota is now in the game with 46 seconds to go. And Zach Moss will run it up the middle. We're at the 42-yard line. Oh, boy. I don't love this situation at all. I'm going to take off with Mariota. Nope, that's not going to go anywhere. It'll be third and seven. Simmons going to get credit for another sack here. Yeah, I, I didn't call a timeout. It doesn't matter. Let's just run it out. Get to overtime. Oh, that was bad. That was an ugly drive there. That was an ugly drive. Um, Tails never fails. Uh, it failed. Okay. Well. Uh, sweet. You know, I was going to go with heads, but, you know, I think we're going to lose that toss no matter what. All right. We're going to. That's why I wanted it just to go to overtime because I figured we could get Richardson back. We just we lost the coin toss. Which really sucks. I mean, I guess I could have called a timeout. Maybe he could have come back. But it was just a bad situation. A very, very bad situation. Okay, here we go. We've got overtime. First and 10 from the 20. And that ball is going to be completed. 
15 of 19, 221 yards and two touchdowns for Trey Lance. A touchdown will win it. A field goal and we'll have a chance. Come on, defense, please. Give Richardson a chance. And it's another quick pass. Uh, this, is, this is how it's going to be, isn't it? Where they're just going to quick pass at us. Uh, you know what? Let's run man, press. That'll take that away. And now they're going to run it for like 20 yards. And it will be a run to the upside that we're loaded on. And Henry will have a huge run. Break 10 million freaking tackles. 200 yards rushing for Derrick Henry. And uh, yeah, that's going to just about do it here. We're going to lose this one. Unless uh, we can actually stop Henry who's in the zone. Nope, that, that will do it. We can't beat this team, man. I can't stop Derrick Henry. He kills us every time. Wow. We lose a heartbreaker in Tennessee, 34-28. And, uh, I mean, it was a fun game. We were down 21 nothing. We stormed all the way back to tie it up at 28. And then Richardson got hurt, and that really screwed things up. 22 of 34, 245 yards, 64% completion percentage. But you know what killed us in this game? Was Trey Lance throwing through three defenders and completing the passes. That's what killed us. Yeah, Derrick Henry ran all over us. We would have won the game if Trey Lance, you know, didn't have magical powers. 16 of 20, 232 yards, two touchdowns for him. Henry, 20 carries, 219. I mean, he averaged 11 yards per carry, man. Three rushing touchdowns. <laughs> JT, 13 for 62. Richardson has 60 yards rushing, two touchdowns. Pittman, 10 for 146 and two touchdowns. Um, no one else really did much. Then defensively, Justin Snow had six tackles. Darrell Moses, uh, Darrell Moses, had, not Darrell Moses, uh, uh, Darrell Moses had a really good game. Two TFLs, had a sack. Buckner, two TFLs, really? I, I didn't see it. He was non-existent. He's been bad. He's been really bad. This season, he's just been really bad. Desmond Crothers had a sack. Moses with the sack as well. No interceptions, although we probably should have had three. But, you know, we just... The ball apparently isn't catchable when it goes right through you. And that'll do it. We lose it 34-28. Got a bunch of upgrades here. Uh, Moses, let's give him field general. Overall, I think he played pretty well. Do we win this game with Shaq and uh, and uh, Brian Holmes? Maybe. I mean, maybe that's the difference of the game right in the game right there. Because Shaq has been good against. He's been able to tackle Derrick Henry. We'll just say that. Um, so maybe. I, you never know. Brian Holmes with an upgrade. We'll give him run stopper. And uh, he's a sixty-seven overall and uh eric greer he had a couple of really nice returns let's just give him playmaker but i need to get holloman back in there to uh to return it uh blake freeland will give pass protector he's our main backup tackle because we do tend to have a lot of injuries uh at tackle especially on the right side taj holloman let's give him um let's do let's do deep threat get some of his route running up catching traffic and catching go up spectacular catch goes up yeah let's get his deep route running up that'll really help us out uh josh chapman needs uh, it needs to be run stopper man uh he's gonna have to replace buckner and then we're gonna have to find plus three block shen is huge it's at 80 now we're gonna have to find somebody to replace Buckner in the offseason. Uh, he's done, man. He's done. Like, run support for Brian Branch. Um, wow, well, got a lot of pass covers there. And then Anthony Richardson. What do we want to do for Richardson? 
I mean, his accuracies are so high. Um, let, let's just, um, let's just do field general. I want to work on improviser and his throw on the run here a little bit, but I want to get, ooh, a plus one throw power. Okay, so he's at a ninety-eight throw power. Let's get it. How about this? Let's get his accuracies into the nineties, and then we'll start working on his throwing the run and under pressure again. So that's probably probably what we'll do with him. But yeah, that's a tough loss, man. QB one check in here. Richardson, whenever we don't win, it feels like the days move slower. I'm going to spend all week watching film on our next opponent, so I don't feel like this again. Overall, I thought Richardson played well. Some of the inaccurate throws drive me nuts, but we still have a lot of time left in the season. You have the right attitude, though. Use it as motivation, and let's take it to them in our next game. Look, division games are tough, right? We're not going to go perfect in the division. We're not the Chiefs. You know, we're not Patrick Mahomes. Um... And even he loses, right? So that's just how it goes. Uh, we've got a tough one against the 49ers. I'm not sure how much of their team is intact. Their defense is in, in 88 overall, though. So really good. Uh, ninth best defense in the league. Our defense is 25th, allowing 26 points per game. Um, our passing yards per game, man, we're 27th. That's rough. Our rushing yards, uh, we were first. That's been tanked. Yeesh. Yeah, I mean, our defense, man, our defense is brutal. They're really good against the run. They're not good against the pass, though. So, we'll see how it goes next week. Uh, Tennessee's 3-1. and one. We're 2-2. Two and two, And we'll be playing the 2-2 two and two San Francisco 49ers. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hit that like button if you did. Subscribe if you guys are new to the channel and i'll see you guys in week number five against the san francisco 49ers